Yeah, this is one of those wines that really annoyed the holy bejesus out of me because it was so hard to get information out of them. And then when I finally did, it was a fascinating story. <clears throat> And so I start to taste the wine. I go, I'm not going to like this wine. I go, oh, man, this is good. It's fascinating wine. <laughs> this it is, is Zin really... Syrah, which is a bizarre blend. Well, but... yes and no. I mean, you know, but still, I mean, my gosh, this guy, this guy's really a loon, you know, but he makes some incredible wines. And, and he's having fun. You know, I think that's, that was really the fun part is he's having, he's having fun. He just doesn't want to tell you what he's doing. Actually, they do. They just don't know how. I think their website was all messed up. Anyway, uh, but it turns out to be an unbelievable bottle of wine. $14 on the shelf would be a steal, $7.99 uh, at the reorder. That's like a highway robbery. Well, I get the Zin spiciness. Absolutely. Clearly, but it'd be great Zin on its own, it seems like. And then you get this Syrah that sort of gives a little punch at the end with That's some, right. with some exactly. blueberry and stuff. Exactly, and it just it perfectly blended. It's beautifully made wine. I'm giving it a 96. And it says, serve with mammoth. Mm-hmm. <laughs> and it does, you know, it's interesting. And let's see, where's this? what's the district? California, because the alcohol content is just approaching 15 percent so it's got to be from you it's know from, the it's from lodi there's some parts of it are from lodi yeah. it comes from about four different areas and it's five different grapes all right so it's it's all over the board but the fact is who cares you know i mean these sommeliers now they want pure wine they want wines that are unobstructed by any outside influence and are all from the same vineyard it makes that's, no that, sense that's impossible you want good wine idiot don't you or do you want or, or do you want a label you know drink the label now. who are you calling an idiot i give a 96 too i think it's great great value great value cheers for us.